Welcome to Brent Replays with Himself, a Let's Play series where I go back and play some games I love because I love them. On this episode, Island. Just Island again. That's all. Just more Island. Just gotta get to the mansion. It's an Island. Batman. Fucking classic Batman. A bat cave? Yes! Obviously! I have to say... Oh, excuse me. I have to say... That is something I have often thought of. Like... Bane has this chemical that makes you super fucking strong. Joker is a homicidal fucking maniac. Are we to really believe that he wouldn't be like, uh, yes please, give that here, right now. I want that, inside me. Sorry. Like, absolutely fucking lutely he would. absolutely fucking lutely he would. Leveled up! Oop. Multiple frequency! What's up, boys? Oh, fuck you! Balls deep in your mother eye. What the fuck just happened? Good headshot. What are they building? I play this game when I'm super stressed. Like, I've had a rough day. I'm not proud to say, due to my job title, but nine times out of ten, what I do is. I beat the shit out of criminals in this game, and imagine it's the people who have pissed me off that day. Not healthy, but... Home away from home. Hey guys! It's me, Batman! Yep. Ah, oh, you guys weren't affected by that? Ah, oh, shit. Nailed it! I truly am... The Batman. Shit! Oh my god, that was so fucking lucky. That was timed perfectly. I punched him in the butt! In the butt punch! The butt punch fidgeter. To the bat cave, everyone. Come! We go! To the bat cave. Where everything happened. What the fuck? What's up here? Can I get up here? Is there anything up here? I don't remember being able to get up here. Hmm? What's up here? Nothing? Then why am I up here? I 
not for me. No, you are up here for no reason. What about over here? No? To get me off the trail. But up here, up here is something. Oh, I know there's something up here. Hey, Riddler, been a while. I could have, but it was kind of out of my way, and I didn't. I'm kind of lazy, if I'm being honest. I'm really fucking lazy. Oh, yes. Aww. I'm sure everything turned out great. Shouldn't use my grapple hook so much. That's the weird thing. You think he uses his grapple hook as like a crutch? Can you climb up there? I could. Or... Grapple hook! Dude, just do a pull up. Nah, grapple hook. You put that there, and then you fucking remade a wall. That's not easy to do. Stop, it. Stop being me. The moon. Ah, oh, suicide point, eh? That's a superhero landing. 100%. Scan my face! Oh, my whole body. It's like, oh, the face matches. And then you get to the torso, and it's like, does the torso match? But that's not what the computer's scanning. It scans it as like a, sure, let's scan this. Programmed by Bruce Wayne. FYI. But it's when it gets here, to the crotch... That's when the scanner's like, okay, pay attention. Because his dick should be in a very specific position. As per. Mm, shower. Um, that's what I think. It's like, facial recognition. But what about cock recognition? Do we know this cock? Does this cock look familiar? Oh, yeah. That's, that's Batman's cock. We got this, boys. Allow him access. How big? Big as my duke? Big dick boy? Power button up there. Oh. I'll look at it later. Because I can't. No one does that. That is the most unrealistic thing. I've never once, working, been like, oh, uh, hmm, yeah. How? Shirt. What are we looking at? Batclaw. Joker referenced that earlier. So that rip in my chest. That should be the armored part. Wait a minute. That's the armored part. Why is that? No. Actually, I might need that. That box has all my snacks, so I need it. Okay. I gotta say... You hit it as a wall because you're like, I don't want people to know. Oh, 
But he did some. I bet he activates it. Oh, I was gonna say, when they walk up to it, and it scans their body, they're gonna be like, oh, I found Batman's fucking secret place. Fuck you. You don't get to talk. Shh. My god, he faced into the floor. Ah, come on. In Arkham Knight, I could do that. Shh, for a minute. Oh, I'm drunk, guys. Like, I'm drunk. Oh, shit, that was short. Okay. Bathroom break, because I'm drunk. And I broke my seal. Five people there. I will say in Arkham City, when you can grapple the uh, Riddler trophies, amazing. But, just in case you were wondering, Arkham City had way too many. What's up? Whoa! Fuck you! I am so sick! Where do you go? You? Should I get him out of the water? Oh, he's not ragdoll. There's no ragdoll effects. Well, you're fucked. I'm done. Bye. Riddler trophy. Ah, yeah. I came a little when I did that. Wow. I am getting blatantly derogatory. I'm so sorry. This has stopped being a child-friendly stream. Oh, God. Oh, you tease. Can I grab it? Ah, come on. Nothing there. This is the same as this. And that defeats the purpose of it. Why do I care? Huh! Shit. Oh no? I don't know what you want me to do about that. Sorry, my brother just texted me, and he's like, oh, I'm walking to the pub to grab a pint, and this woman was on the phone on my way, and she made a comment, she was visibly upset, and she was like, I'm just hungry all the time, I'm just fed up of being hungry, and she was pushing a stroller, and she's like, I can't sleep because I'm so hungry, and he was like, whoa, that's really sad. And when I, when I read it, I was like, oh, that's really sad. And then he followed it up with, then I thought, is she just on a diet? <laughs> and I was like, yes. Yes. Not like, yes. Tell you about it. I was just like, yes. As in, that's what I would do. And he goes, me too. Back to our lives. <laughs> We're fucking psychopaths. Oh. 
okay. Um, I don't know if you know this, Barbara. Barbara, I'm fucking busy. I'm dealing with some shit here, okay? I love that. Oh man, there's death threats. This, oh my god, there's death threats. Some joke. Go on. Batman, are you okay? I'm almost finished, if that's what you're asking. Gross! What? Huh? Oh. I'll be back for you. This way. Ha! Okay. Go with the flow, I guess. Whatever, that was funny. Oh, shit. No. I think it's up here. 90% sure the riddle I'm thinking of is. Fucking right here! Oh, thank God. Thought I'd lost my touch. That solved it? Oh, it shouldn't have. It was clearly out of line. Huh. How's that swing? I don't know why. That, to me, just seems like such a good, like, realistic graphic. Just him landing and then swinging and then using that propulsion to knock himself up. Not knock himself up. Oh, I should go to the pub. Go to the pub tomorrow morning. Ah, oh, fuck you, Waylon. Oh shit, I forgot. I forgot about Penelope. Bunny. <laughs> that wasn't that all the fucking accent I was using for these. Betty Young was always a brilliant student who was prepared to do anything to advance professionally. She was built up a reputation for being a cold, calculating woman, focused only on the project at hand. She was hired at Arkham Asylum by Warden Quincy Sharp to head up the Asylum's research department and to finally restore to sanity the more deranged of Gotham City's supervillains. I got eerily quiet because I was thinking of something. And what I was thinking of was the difference between Batman villains and Superman villains. Because it's a common debate as to who's better. And nine times out of ten, it's Batman. Always. Nine times out of ten. That's a very Anchorman comment. 90% of the time, every time. Um, now there's snipers. Um, what was I saying? Oh, shit. Okay. Um, anyway. 
one of the common debates is who's better, Batman or Superman? And what I like to base that on is obviously there's like the who's cooler, which sure, that is an argument that can be made. But I don't think it's the key argument to be made. So what I always do is talk about not who I think is cooler. Are you down there looking at me? Um, I think of the villains. So who's better? I would have to say... Who deals with the worst people? And I honestly have issues thinking of worse villains than Batman villains. Okay, I gotta go to the mansion. And... I, I think that because, A, a majority of his villains involve fucking post-traumatic shit. Great. Like... Punched in the butt and kicked in the face. Um, like all of his villains are like post traumatic. So if you look at it, obviously his big one is Joker. Joker is a failed comedian who was forced into a life of crime to pay for his fucking debts. His wife was killed in an accident. And as a result, like, what happens to him? Oh, he still has to go through with it and become the Red Hood. So you think, oh, okay, that fucking sucks. But put yourself in his shoes. During the robbery of Ace Chemicals, Batman stops him. A new Batman. A Batman who's unfamiliar with the criminal underworld of Gotham. He's done the training, he's done everything like that, but it's it, it's within his first year, I think, of him becoming Batman. And he ends up like, that's him. Like, he he ends up getting attacked by Batman, falling into the vat of chemicals, becoming Joker. Joker is a byproduct of society and Batman. Batman made Joker. Fucking come over here so I can fucking choke you out. Um, then you look at, like, Scarecrow. Scarecrow is someone who goes after your worst fears. But, of course, Superman's immune to that shit. So, like, what? Like, he's immune to it. Because Superman's immune to fucking everything, because he's an alien. Who's powered by the sun. But getting out of that, because I don't want to focus on the stupidity of character creation. I'd rather focus on, this is what, like, like facts. Anyway. That's personal feeling. I get the understanding of Superman. Anyway. 
Then you have people like the fucking Mad Hatter. I'll continue after this. Um, Mad Hatter is, I'm continuing this conversation like nothing fucking happened. Mad Hatter comes out of fucking nowhere. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Upgrade. Level up. I want you. If I'm playing on hard and I'm drinking, I need all the edge I can get. Um, it's a remind like Mad Hatter is a reminder of fucking the last book that his mother ever read to him. Psychological shit again. Um, so, more psychological. Now, don't get me wrong. There are aspects of Superman that are also cool. You have villains like, let's start off with the most obvious ones. Lex Luthor. Lex Luthor was... One of the most, I don't know. I don't even know what I was saying there. He's a corporate douchebag. He's corrupt. Good villain. I'm not saying he's a bad villain. Good villain. He became fucking president. I gotta go to the bathroom up here. Lex Luthor. Good villain. Corrupt. Corporate. Symbol. I get it. He became president. Complicated villain. I just don't think you compare it to, like, the Joker. Because the Joker is someone who just does shit for the shit of doing shit. <laughs> that's, that's him. That's all he does. Thank you all so much for watching. To join my guests and I live, check out our Twitch channel, Nearly Competent. You can reach us at the social media links in these credits. And if you want to support us even more, check out our Patreon. Thank you to the fiends currently supporting us. We will see you all next time. Have a good evening.